the soundtrack of a better world. We are one. Welcome to the Progressive Birdhouse. Friends, and welcome back to the Progressive Bird House. I am Bird One, and thank you so much for joining us. I have an awful lot of new things to share with you over the next uh, 17 or 18 hours that this show usually lasts. Not just some of my own tracks, but I do have not one, but two new releases to throw your way. One just came out late last week, and one's coming out on April 12th, but more on that later. We got a whole bunch of new material coming at you from the likes of Cream, which you just heard from. And of course, something new from Above and Beyond, Fair Play, Cascade, Dead Mouse, Dave Seaman. Yes, I will always pronounce it that way because you guys can't be trusted. Echo, Resident, 
uh, DT8 Project remix by Super 8 and Tab, No Mass remix, a No Mass remix of a Camilo San Clemente track. And I haven't played Camilo, Camilo on the main show in quite some time. New tracks from Miss Monique and even Seven Lions. So stick around for the second hour. It's going to be a hell of a show.
my friends. It looks like some of you maybe is a little confused as to why my upcoming track called You Are Not Alone is not available on Bandcamp. It's actually coming out on Clubhouse Records, which means I can't really sell it in my own store. But you will be able to grab it at avianinvasion.com slash not alone.
hope this is bringing a little bit of light into your darkness on a Wednesday afternoon. Of course, it's getting less and less dark as the time progresses, at least here in the Northern Hemisphere. And I got some feedback over the last week from Thera Sinclair over in Germany saying, Hey Avian, just wanted to tell you that your light has reached out to the other side of the planet and helped me big time since I discovered you on the 9th of February through a Final Fantasy party. I've been listening almost daily since on YouTube and love all the things you are doing and the positive vibes you're sending out. Your sets and music are amazing and I wish for all your future success. I hope I can send a little light back with those words and with putting some 20 bucks into that tip jar of yours. Well, thank you so much, Thera Sinclair. Not just for uh, helping out towards the uh, Neotropolis Fund, but also for letting me know. The only thing that I want on this planet is to know that the light of good music is lifting you up and that you're passing it along. And speaking of passing it along, Thank you so very, very much to Timmy Jenkins for raiding in with all of your friends. Welcome to the invasion. Oh, and thank you very much. I'm guessing Eagle Beagle or whoever was Johnny on the spot with a shout out there. Took me a hot minute to get there. We're about 40 minutes away from the new music hour, so if you just raided in, please stick around. You never know what kind of chaos might ensue. And of course, awful lot of new progressive house, trance, techno, and more coming at you in the second hour. This is Avian Invasion. Casey and Andrew Connix for tossing a couple hundred bits into the stream here. I missed the on-screen confetti. Newcomers here on the channel, let me tell you how this works. Every time a hype train starts on this channel, we start with an engine shot. If we make it past level three, I'll play an original track for you. And of course, if we, if we, if I can speak properly, if we break any multiple of level five after that, we bust out the harder shots for a caboose shot. Looks like Pup Casey spun the wheel, and we're starting off with a toast with the Taiku Junmai Ginjo. So grab your glasses, no matter what you're pouring into it. And let's have a toast, shall we? for tossing this bottle my direction. Thankfully, not physically. It is time for a toast, my friends, as that hype train rolls on. Wow, we're already into level two with four and a half minutes still on the clock. So here is to all of my trans friends out there. 
It's a little late, I know, but happy belated Trans Day of Visibility. No matter where you are on this planet, and no matter what your current status, you are visible, you are loved, and you are always welcome here in the birdhouse. Cheers. is nice and smooth this train rolls on with three and a half minutes you're a third of the way through level two at this point and it's time for another tiny corgi that's right if you don't have two nickels to rub together you can spend those seeds of awesomeness and make all kinds of chaos happen around here oh we're at 66 percent thank you wildcard for tossing out another gift subscription oh this is moving quick Wherever Quiet Fire is right now, this one's for you, of course. Waiting for the break of dawn To find the lies beyond the door Oh, I just saw the lights change again. We're into level three with a thousand bits from a driver 2386. The clock resets again. And I'll see the world when the night is down. Down to the river in the blazing sun Blazing sun Blazing sun Blazing sun Go down to the river in the blazing sun Blazing sun Blazing sun Blazing sun Go down to the river in the blazing sun on this train. We may be ending in level three, but you still got two minutes left to see how far it goes and maybe make it to an original track.
Thank you very much for pushing it all the way into level three. No caboose shot this round. But you'll have more chances as the show rolls on. Of course, we're just half an hour away from starting the new music hour. Thank you so very, very much for your continued support.
this. Thank you very much to Cat for tossing in $4.48. Saying a big hint for next week's anniversary with Avian Invasion. Uh-oh. A big hint? I'm not sure what you mean by that, but we are now at 529.37. 35% of the way towards the goal. And just about $470 shy of that shot of Opal. That terrible, 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 terrible liqueur, but I'll do it once we get there.
try this, shall we? I uh, took off all of the uh, the low end roll offs. We'll see if that's any better. Of course, uh, the only reason the mic may sound a little different is because I had to drop seven hundred dollars unexpectedly on a new audio interface when the last one that had served me well for twelve years has died unexpectedly. So thank you once again, those of you that are hitting the tip jar. Because God knows, as I'm saving up for Neotropolis later this month, I was not expecting to dump $700 on a new interface. If you want to help out with this, by the way, please hit me at avianinvasion.com slash tip jar. And please keep the feedback on the microphone quality coming in. Please let me know how the levels and the quality are sounding. It looks like we're doing a little bit better right now. Just let me know. I'll see what I can do mid-flight.
much to Matt C188 for wanting an original with some singing and Ciala for throwing some guitar. Uh, I need to reload some batteries on the guitar before I can make that happen, so why don't I just bring you an original track? And I promise you, after the... After the new music hour is done, we'll get to the singing and guitar, or maybe in the middle of the new music hour, because I do have some new music. Until then, here's another preview of the upcoming album. An Avian Invasion Original. This is a little track called Let's Go from yours truly. Oh, 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 
I managed to bring the guitar back to life just in time to uh, play the lead part on that track. Jackalobes is wondering, how far away is that new album, I wonder? Well, that depends on how close to Seattle you live, I guess. Originally, it was going to be released sometime last year, but we never got the chance to shoot the video for it. Well, now we actually have it scheduled. Now, since we're going way up into the mountains, we're obviously going to have to wait until the roads are passable, because these are fire roads, dirt roads. And right now, they are entirely mud. So it is very likely that this album will be coming out just after that video is done being shot, probably sometime in late June or early July. So if you want to get your hands on this one as soon as it's available, join me at avianinvasion.com slash join. Or you can get the uh, sneak preview, the uh, Officers Club mixes of all these tracks at avianinvasion.com slash Patreon. Of course, I always appreciate your support right here on this channel. That hype train earlier, all those bits, the cheering, the subscriptions, well, it goes somewhere, and I'll tell you where, right here. New music. Join Avian Invasion and explore the hottest new sounds in trance, progressive, and more. Every week, the new music hour begins now. Like I said, we got a whole bunch of brand new tracks coming at you including a couple from yours truly. This one's hitting you from Dave Seaman and Quiver. This is The Water's Edge. But we've also got new music coming at you from Cream, Echo, Resident, Camilo San Clemente, Zoe Johnston, and Above and Beyond. Always happy to have them on board. Super 8 and Tab remixing something from DT8 Project, Miss Monique, Seven Lions, Illenium, and more. So stick around and thank you once again for supporting this show and making it possible for me to purchase an entire hour or more of new music every single week.
That one's actually out in the world right now. You can find that at avianinvasion.com slash one day. Whether you just want to stream it, you want to pick it up off of Beatport or Apple Music or even Bandcamp. You can listen for free or you can support the invasion. Either way works. But do check it out. I'm so happy that one is finally seeing the light of day. And now we head over to Echo. And resident, resident, 
My tongue is getting stuck in my beak here. The brand new track called Only For A Moment. new track, this time from Fairplay. It's named after my absolute favorite movie. Okay, that's not true, but it is the same name as my favorite movie. The Abyss. Yes, 
you are correct, Quiet Fire. It is taco night. Hence why the show ends at 6.30 on Wednesdays. Because I got people coming over. A million light years away. Well, actually, they're coming right here, not a million light years away. Angels once thought loving. Fools in redemptive struggle. I see we've been joined by none other than Hausman Music here in the chat. Everybody say hi. A million light years away. Another earth locked in stillness. Angels once thought loving. Forced in redemptive struggle. Exhausted by an endless battle. Life begins to fade. control over how the new music hour unfolds here, especially since we got Hausman in the audience now, because the new track, which drops on April 12th on Clubhouse Records, isn't just my track. Oh no, Hausman did a techno remix and it slaps. Oh boy, does it slap. So let me know here at avianinvasion.com slash live sometime in the next few minutes. Vote in the poll and let me know which version you want to hear during the new music hour. Of course, you may only get one of them, but there is an option to vote for both.
like in tiny print, and clearly I have some more OBS work to do. The overwhelming winner of this little poll is you want to hear both of them, so, well, we'll see what we can do. The new music hour is probably going to run a little bit long this time around if we throw yet another track into it. It's coming out on April 12th, but you're going to get a full, full earful of it right here in the Progressive Birdhouse. earlier me we are not there yet oh no we're gonna work our way up to those versions i might just play it back to back i'm not kidding you guys asked for it but right now we're kicking it over to cascade dead mouse the moth and the flame basically kx5 you know with some insects flying around which usually for me that's good enough but this brand new remix just hit Beatport. That's right. Time for some cream to go with my coffee. This is Alive. You are alive. Yeah, I suppose that makes sense. You are beautiful. You are not alone.
may or may not be aware that I am also this month's house guest on Clubhouse Radio. If you're not tuned in and you like what you're hearing here, you definitely need to subscribe to Clubhouse Radio. Head over to either YouTube, SoundCloud, I think it's also on Mixcloud, and look up Clubhouse Records. We recently uh, just released that on April Fool's Day, no less. I still haven't heard the actual version. Just the one with... Let's just say a little extra herbs and spices, courtesy of Devin. We have such similar tastes in music. I stole one of the tracks he wanted to play, and he stole one of mine. And that would be this one, from Above and Beyond, with Zoe's amazing angelic vocals. Remixed by Anna Cram, this is Crazy Love. Thank you once again to those of you that threw out that hype train uh, a little over an hour ago. All of this new music is made possible because of your support. Avian Invasion. You know one thing I love about you. You don't care which foot slips in. There's no
Heading now to another Camilo San Clemente track, a Nomas remix of Away.
So as requested, it's time for an Avian Invasion Original. And I'm going first. That's right. This is the track that's dropping on April 12th. You'll be able to grab it everywhere once it's out. Of course, you can find where to pre-save it. Whether it's on Spotify or Beatport or elsewhere, hit avianinvasion.com slash not alone and as more live links come along, I'll make sure that they're live on that page. But until then, sit back and enjoy the ride and listen to the message.
from yours truly and of course I'll be throwing another version at you soon but let's take a little step back from this one for the time being heading to one of my favorite producers a Ukrainian and an absolute talent behind the decks as much as she is behind whatever DAW she makes her music in this is Miss Monique with Bloom at Night right here in the new music hour And again, thank you guys so much for all the bits, the subscriptions, and the hype trains that make all this new music possible. Every little bit helps. This is Avian Invasion.
course, now we turn to another one of my favorite producers. This one is not in Ukraine, but the humble little town of Denver. You might have heard of him before. And this is what you're also going to be getting on April 12th. That's right. A killer, killer techno remix from Hellman. Yeah, we're just going to go with that. I haven't even been drinking that much. There's only been one sake shot. Maybe that's what's throwing me off. for supporting all this new music. Oh, and Wild Card 9 for tossing in 100 bits on top of it. Appreciate it, my friend. I need to bring you another original track, but I'm going to wait till we're done with the new music hour because it's been pretty me heavy so far. For those of you that are new here, here's how this works. Every time a hype train starts on this channel, we start with an engine shot. And it looks like it's going to be the Jinro Chamasul. If we make it past level three, which we already have, thank you to Natolu's amazing gift bomb there. Then I play you an original track, and if we break level five, we move on to the harder shots for the caboose shot. This bottle was provided to me by the wonderful Aquarian Orbiter. Hey, thank you, Endraconics, for tossing in 100 bits as well. So here's to release day, my friends. I'm so very much looking forward to seeing this one get out there in the wild. And remember, you are not alone. Even if you work from home, we're all here with you. Even if you feel like you are the only one on planet Earth right now, you are surrounded by the invasion.
Oh, so very, very good. One of the things that I absolutely love about what I do is not just seeing how people react on the dance floor or hearing messages like I read earlier from all the way around the world, but when something that I've made inspires somebody else to create something, whether that's a remix, a new track, a sculpture, you name it. It is the highest compliment that you can pay to any artist. That and not using AI. But I digress. The new music hour continues, as does this hype train. We're sort of stuck at the beginning of level four with 90 seconds left. So let's kick it over into something else from Cream. This is so high. Oh my goodness, what just happened to Tolu with another 10 gift subscriptions? And that pushes us into level six. Hype train level five complete. And thanks to Tofernat for spending 12,000 seeds of awesomeness. Looks like we're doing a double shot for the caboose shot here. And the clock resets with another five minutes on it, my friends. Oh, looks like we're doing a little bit of spice drum and chasing it with some sake. I should make a cocktail out of this because that actually sounds pretty damn tasty. So I hope you'll raise a toast with me, my friends. Join us. is one of the finest sakis, the Horin Gekikan Sake, a birthday gift from DJ Rekka. And on your right, Whistling Andy's Spiced Rum, another gift from Jade the Gecko. Hey, thank you very much, Sea Better, for tossing in a thousand bits. Pushing that hype train ever closer to level seven already. So cheers to you, my friends, for throwing so much support behind independent music, saying no to the procedurally generated garbage that infests the world. Here's to all of you who craft your own art by hand, pouring your love, your soul, and your spirit into something for others to appreciate. Cheers. Spice drum has a bit of a bite, but oh, the aftertaste is so good. But we are chasing that with a random shot. I can't guarantee the quality of the show after this. But since this bottle came from DJ Rekka, here's to those of you who will lend your time and your talents to mentor others. There is a special place for all those of you who reach a hand down to pull those behind you upward not cutting off the rungs of the ladder underneath you but helping to haul people up to the top along with you DJ Rekka has been a big help for me and I hope that you can be a big help to someone else cheers You said you haven't had enough shots today. Well, I mean, if this train makes it past level 10, we're doing even more. But you've only got 60 seconds left on that clock, and we are still not done with the new music hour. As a matter of fact, I've got 
some actual factual trance coming at you. A Super 8 and Tab remix of DT8 Project. Uh, 30 seconds left. You're only about a third of the way through level 6. I say only. That is absolutely nuts. So let's kick it into high gear for this last 20 seconds on this clock. See how far we can go. And yes, for those of you wondering, I still haven't redeemed that sing reward yet. Literally 20 of which just from Natolu. Thank you so very, very much. And 1,700 bits tossed in. Thank you for keeping the lights on in here, giving each other an ad-free experience, helping me build a new studio, and of course, letting me buy all this amazing new music every single week.
Oh my goodness. So spiced rum, some sake, and some, uh, uh, well, uh, I still don't even know how to pronounce whatever this is. The Jinro Ch- Chamisul? Chamisul? You got me on that one. I don't know. But the new music hour continues. I'm chasing down our happiness But all we do is make a mess I'd rather bear the loneliness And I suffer in silence with you We're always trying, never realizing This fire we're fighting is burning us up Yeah, we're surviving, but we're still dying It is time 
To go back into, I guess, the regular music hour. An hour ago, Matt C188 spent an awful lot of seeds of awesomeness for some singing, and now after some rum, some sake, some other Asian spirits, it is time for this bird to try and sing. You get what you pay for. Thank you so much to Hausman Music. I mean Hausman. I mean Devin. For helping me release this brand new track. And of course, for that amazing remix. It's raining, it's pouring, a black sky is falling, it's cold tonight. in the middle of singing. I'm so sorry. You'll never get over me.
see when I get the new studio built, I will spend an awful lot of time with things like camera exposure and color balancing. It's hard to see when you're changing the bird face color lights. I'm going to talk to some actual photographers and see if I can make it so, like, everything looks a little better. Just this past weekend, though, we taped the drywall. It's starting to look like room. My favorite holiday is the day after. 
Discount Peep Day. Oh, yes. I will absolutely destroy me some of these. I don't care what they're in the shape of. They are so cheap, these peeps. And they are everywhere. shots into me that I go upstairs just like uh, no, no, no.
I'm loving that there is an entire discussion now around peeps in white wine. Has anyone ever tried it with red wine? Hmm. I got a box of Costco wine upstairs. We could make that happen. And I'm pretty sure I'm not going to ruin the wine. It's a box of Costco wine. Okay, so Dazed Angel here, uh, Dazed Angel 510 in the chat, has an interesting suggestion. Skipping the white wine, skipping the red wine, and I quote, just use vodka and get to the point. Well, I happen to have some very nice corgi vodka here, thanks to uh, Takala Mackerwolf. And we're at 529 and change here in the tip jar. Let's say if we make it to 650. It's a little over a hundred bucks away. We'll do a corgi vodka and peep shot. I'm gonna regret this, but only if you make me. We'll see what happens. If you want to make it happen, we're gonna hit 650 at avianinvasion.com slash tip jar, which is also, by the way, helping me and Andraconics get to Neotropolis without going flat broke for a gig out in the desert in a cyberpunk wasteland. into the tip jar. We're getting closer. 579. 
and I dump my peeps onto the decks. I guess they're doing the DJing now. I can I can just walk away. been mentholated so it basically tastes like black jelly beans salt and like Vicks vapor rub I don't know why they even make it and I doubt a peep would go well with it but hey we'll do that if we hit a thousand I'll actually I'll actually go for the peep thing as well on that one but that's probably a bad idea so I'm gonna queue up a track real quick and then we're gonna do oh my goodness we are going to, in fact, soak a peep in Corgi Vodka and down the thing. So it seems only fitting I'm going to hit you with this. An avian invasion original. So Dazed Angel, I hope you're happy. We're going to see how well this concoction works. As Andrew Connick said here in the chat, we are trying some mad peep science. And I'm going to throw a little fire under your ass with pilot light from yours truly. to Tikal Mackerel for sending me the absolute last we'll ever see from Corgi Distillery. I can think of no better way to send them off. All right, this might overflow a bit. You need nose plugs? Wait, no. Even better. Here, here you go. Oh yeah, marshmallows float. So tell me, Quiet Fire, does this actually need to be, does it need to like saturate for a while or do you just then do, do you just drink it with it on top? I'm not sure if this is supposed to dissolve or not. All I've got right now is a wet flammable peep. Hausman has his sushi by committee. I have this. Let's try this. As Wildcard 9 suggests, we're going to try a little sip and see if we can get the peep to actually submerge here. Nope, that is only making a mess. All right. You know 
I once tried to roast a peep in a campfire like a marshmallow, expecting that like all marshmallows, it would just expand and toast, and the sugar coating on the outside would like caramelize and turn this beautiful golden brown with a hard candy shell. Instead, I watched on the end of a stick as a peep just stared back angrily at me. Not changing color, not changing shape, just sitting there right up against the coal bed, looking pissed off. I took it off the stick, set it free into the woods, and vowed never to do that again. I hope that peep doesn't come to find me someday. Hopefully this one will go somewhere. Also, thank you. Thank you very much to Pie and Far for tossing another 690 into the tip jar. Nice. No, Danzo to Raccoon, it did not catch fire. Like I said, it sat there in the middle of the fire, just staring at me and looking into my soul. So I guess this is what we got. It's not going to dissolve. It's not going to change anything. Let's just take this, shall we? Thank you guys so much for pushing that tip jar up to 650. We got a long way to go before we hit our ultimate goal. And it's not going to show up now. There we go. Our ultimate goal of $1,500 to get us safely into Neotropolis. But until then, cheers, my friends, and thank you for helping us get there. Okay, I can't say that I would recommend this. Okay, the peep does in fact mellow out the bite of a neat shot of vodka. But that being said, don't try this at home. Remember, I am a professional. And of course, we only have about half an hour left in this show before it's time to get out of here and set up for the beer and taco night that happens every Wednesday in this household. So thank you guys so much for sticking around. This has definitely been, well, a different show. That's for sure. We'll see where it goes after this. But I am so very happy that you guys are coming along for the ride. and sugary back. God help me when I burp. I did just burp, and it was all spiced rum. These are not combinations I would recommend for any of you. <laughs> Leave the experimentation to someone who can be completely disassembled, cleaned out, and rebuilt if something goes wrong. Jesus has arrived. 
Hopefully Trance Easter was good to you. You just missed a shot of peep in vodka. There are clips here on Twitch. Not sure I can recommend. something so abhorrent I can barely bring myself to drink it, let alone bathe in it. We may have to have some sort of a seance for these things. But we'll see. In any case, it's 6 o'clock here on the West Coast with 30 minutes left in the show. Time to trance.
not that peep anymore. You are beautiful. You are not alone. Free your mind.
for not just a level three hype train at the beginning of the show, but a level six hype train a little over an hour ago. Seems like it just happened, but it's been an hour already. And also, of course, those of you that were tossing things into the tip jar to help us get to Neotropolis and to watch me down a vodka peep. Can't recommend, by the way. So for all that support, I'm going to hit you with an avian invasion original. And I'm even going to sing to this one. Y'all get what you pay for. That's all I can say.
yours truly, and we are now at the 10 minute mark, which means we need to figure out who we're going to raid after this. Hopefully they've got their own supply of peeps because nobody's coming after mine. I will fight you. That being said, thank you so much for joining for the last three and a half hours here on a Wednesday afternoon. I'll see you Friday morning at 9 a.m. Pacific time for the early bird breakfast. Now let me know where we heading next. Just Hazel for resubscribing. 18 months now, a year and a half. That's absolutely fantastic. Thank you so very much. You missed the hype train, the level six hype train. Oh, it was a little over an hour ago. But you are free to catch up and jump on board wherever this train may have pulled into the station. for a little G&D and ST with a remix by Eleven. just in one show. Thank you so much, Natolu, for everything you do to keep the lights on around here. 
And of course, to give everybody else on Twitch an ad-free experience and no oh shit. Well, I guess we're not ending in the next five minutes. We're going to run long today because we got another hype train going on with Andraconics tossing in 100 bits. All aboard the hype train. Alrighty, if there's anyone left on Earth who doesn't know how this works, here's how it works. Whenever a hype train starts, we start with an engine shot, which it looks like is going to be the Jinro Kamasul again. Thank you, Takala, for spinning the wheel there. And of course, if we make it past level three, I'll bust out another original track. If we make it past level five, we move on to the hard shots for a caboose shot. We're already about to kill level two here. And oh my god. I did not expect this this late in the show, especially after the vodka peep you all served me earlier. So, not to talk over Subteal, I know Mrs. Yorl is going to run to Gabriel and Dresden and tell them the sins I'm committing. All right, thank you very much, Trans Jesus, for tossing in 138 bits on brand, my friend. Wildcard 9 and Pup Casey as well. Jay Colley with another 200, and we have taken down level 2. The clock resets once again. And of course, thanks to Aquarian Orbiter once again. For this lovely bouncy bottle of Asian liquor. It is sweet, it is clean tasting. It is certainly not something you should drink before driving, that's for sure. It's a little stiff, but it doesn't taste it. And that's why it is dangerous. So here's to all those of you who are dangerous. Whether or not you choose to be, or you just are born that way. Flaunt it, own it. Be dangerous, but in a productive and good way. It pays to disrupt now and again. And all I can say is this. Thank you so much for disrupting my streams week after week. Looks like we're going to go at least another half hour. We'll see how long this hype train lasts. You got three minutes and 30 seconds and you're 17% of the way in. So here's to you, my disruptive friends. Oh, 
Less than one minute to go. Trans Jesus with 69 bits. Nice. And Wildcard 9 topping it off with another 100 bits just to seal the deal. We got five more minutes on the clock, and the next track will be one of mine. Thank you guys so much for pushing it once again. talking to me now. They're outright daring you. Don't be like that. These are merely human beings. They're fragile. side of level four but who knows we may be steaming towards yet another caboose shot which will pretty much put me on the floor at that point but since you busted past level three so damn quickly you know it an avian invasion original this one's the title track off of my procedural generation ep and for the next two minutes we'll see how far it'll help push that train Wow, and out of nowhere, 
Mr. Trance Jesus with this save. That's right, Jesus saves. If you heard nothing else this Easter, it's that. Pushing us all the way to level five now, and the clock resets with another five minutes. Thank you so much, my friend. Between Lead Finn and Trance Jesus, kicking it over the edge. Taking down this level means another caboose shot. Thank God I'm not making the tacos tonight, or they'll all have peeps in them. on that clock. We're now starting it on level five. This train is insane! Once again, for pushing it this far, two minutes left on the clock. That was the procedural generation from yours truly. And I guess we're heading into the last 20 minutes now. No amount of hype training will push me past seven o'clock. I'm basically going to have to sprint out of here and receive the guests. But this train hasn't stopped yet. A little over 90 seconds remain. 86% left before yet another caboose shot. Why do I do this? I want you for the dirty and clean When you're waking in your dreams Make me bite my tongue and make me scream See, I got everything that you need Ain't nobody gonna do it like me We are burning out seconds on the clock and Natolo is going for the gold here. Five more gift subscriptions pushes us up to 98%. We are a Nats ass away from a final caboose shot and Parsi Val tosses in 100 bits and does the deal. Hype train level 5 complete. Oh my god. I'm not exactly sure what I expected but it certainly wasn't this when I got out of bed today. And it is still going. What is love? Looks like Pub Casey spun the wheel of big shots and we're going with the garden party gin. Oh god, I think that's the heavy one. Oh no, it's, it's still heavier than usual. It is time for a toast as we count down another five minutes, starting in on level six. From the Corgi 
Distillery, which is now defunct. And thank you so much to Takala Macrowolf for sending all these bottles my way. We're getting thin on this one now. What we do behind doors is our business. On my body, he giving me kisses. I'm wet when I'm wet, I'm popping like Adderall. Baby, dive in my beach and go swimming. Let's go deep, cause you know there's no limits. Nothing stronger than you when I'm sipping. I'm still gonna finish, I'm drunk, I ain't had enough. One day, you hit and you go. As we count down the remaining three and a half minutes on this level of this hype train, I want to salute all those of you who look at life as one big party. Like any party, there's problems. Things don't go right. You make do with what you have. You improvise. You fix on the fly. But through it all, you smile. Not just for you. Not just because of some social pressure to stay positive. But because your smile is that torch that you can pass to someone else. Just curling up your lips if you have them. May brighten someone else's day. Cheers. inside of level six. Oh, I couldn't believe that you guys started another, a third hype train right as I was about to sign off and go upstairs, relax, disassemble myself, and begin to enjoy some tacos. But we are going to continue on, aren't we? At least another 15 minutes. You have 90 seconds left on this train. Oh my god, I can't believe this. for that hype train rolling to a stop in level six with 17 more gift subscriptions and 2400 bits thank you so very much for bringing your energy for bringing your sense of humor for bringing your weirdness for being everything that I am looking for on this planet with you. Thank you so much. Never change.
Yes, a perennial favorite of mine. between raiding into Gabriel and Dresden or Chris Send Zero. 
I'm highly inclined to go with the person with a whole lot fewer followers and a whole lot less fame because, well, Dave is a great guy and all, but boy does he not need the help from little old me. to be singing right now. I don't think we're rating in that soon. Just like that, half an hour over schedule, thanks to you. It's time for me to retire. I must recharge the batteries, reassemble myself, and purge the (laughs) peep plus vodka taste out of my mouth, because that was largely a mistake. I'll try it with white wine at some point, but we'll see how well that works. In the meantime, thank you so much from the bottom of Every single one of my essential systems, not just the heart, but the CPU, the GPU, and of course, the fish processing unit, the essential part of any bird robot. We're going to head to Chris Send Zero at this point. But for now, I must leave you once again with a giant robot voice. Thank you for listening. This show only exists because of dedicated patrons like these. If you want to hear more, The Invasion needs you at avianinvasion.com slash Patreon. Look for Avian Invasion on Spotify, Mixcloud, YouTube, and everywhere dance music is sold, streamed, or enjoyed. Remember to like, subscribe, and share. Until next time, Bird One reminds you that you are alive, you are beautiful, and you are not alone.